Hello, welcome back to my channel and this is a tutorial on how to draw Kirby. First, we are going to start off by drawing a circle. I decided to use one of my candles as a base, but you can also freehand this if you wish. From here, I'm just trying to make sure that the edges are smoothed out and the line is more visible. Now, it is time to start drawing Kirby's arms. From here, we're going to create two marks like so. Keep in mind that the arms are not a perfect circle when you join them together, but that the edges should be smoothed out nonetheless. After drawing the curve on the inside, we're going to do the same thing on the outside, only this time make sure that you extend this a bit further so that it becomes a more oval circular shape. Now that we've drawn one arm, we're going to draw the other arm by creating two different markings on the other side. However, this time, we're only going to draw the outside curve. For this curve, make sure that the edges are smoothed out. However, it's not going to look exactly like a circle, but more of an oval shape. Now, it is time to draw the feet. For the first one, we're going to do it on the left-hand side. Starting from the corner that we drew our arm, we're going to draw a curve like this. And then on the bottom, we're going to draw another curve like so, which is going to be our new markings. From these two points, we're going to connect two curves, both on the inside and outside of Kirby. Draw this out like so. Make sure that all the edges are smoothed out. For the second foot, we're going to do something similar that we did with the other arm. We're going to draw only the outside curve and we're going to create two markings for this. Again, the edges are smooth, but keep in mind that this is not necessarily a circular shape, more of an oval shape. Now that we've got Kirby's body finished, we are going to start mapping out the other features, including the eyes and the mouth. First, draw a line in the center like so, then create a triangular shape, which will be the mouth. Draw this out like so and make sure that there are no rough edges. From where we drew the mouth, we are going to draw Kirby's eyes directly on top. From here, create two markings that are from the corners of Kirby's mouth, like so. From each corner, extend into oval-like curves that go all the way up to a certain point and draw both of these out like so. Make sure that when you are drawing the other eye, that they match with the previous eye, as well as making sure that there are no rough edges. Everything is smoothed out as Kirby doesn't have any sharp edges.
as you can see here I did make a bit of a mistake so feel free to rub out any mistakes that you make during this video. To finalize the detail on Kirby's eyes, first start off with drawing a circle like this. Now we're going to create another circle around this circle, leaving a bit of a gap. Draw this out like so. Now from the circle that we just created, we're going to draw another oval like shape which will match the oval shape of the larger circle which is Kirby's eyes. Finally, starting from the center, we're going to draw another oval shape only this time it's going to be much smaller. Draw this out like so. When everything is completed on the first eye, do your best to mimic this on the second eye if you need to, you can slow down this video and you can take some time to draw each circle symmetrically. Almost every detail is complete. Now it's time for us to rub out these markings that we created previously. Rub out everything like so. For the last and final detail, we're going to finish off Curvy's mouth by drawing another curve like this. From the little corners of the eyes, we're going to draw little ovals which will be Kirby's cheeks. Be sure to make this symmetrical on the other side. Here I'm also fixing up any touches to make sure that everything smoothed out. Now that we finished drawing, it is time to colour Kirby in. Grab the necessary tools as I'm going to be using colour pencil in this video. We're going to start with the hardest bit which is Kirby's eyes. Grab a light blue pencil and we're going to colour in the inside circle like this. Make sure to keep your pencil sharp as it will give a more accurate colouring. Now with the circle directly underneath, use a black colouring pencil. Now we're going to use a darker blue pencil to colour in the other circle underneath but then we're going to create a gradient by using the lighter pencil. Do this on both sides like so and feel free to pause the video. Finally for the outer rings use your black colouring pencil. Now it is time to do Kirby's cheeks. For Kirby's cheeks, I am using a darker pink which is sort of a purplish colour like so. Make sure to colour his cheeks evenly and lightly, creating swirls patterns like this. Now it is time to do Kirby's mouth. Get a maroon colouring pencil and start colouring the first top layer like this. Start off by carefully outlining this part and then go ahead and fill it in. Feel free to pause the video if you wish. Now grab a red colouring pencil and start filling in the rest of Kirby's mouth. You can also use a black colouring pencil to create some shadows and feel free to use a rubber to rub out any messy markings. 
Now that we got the hard features of Kirby done, we can start colouring in the rest of Kirby's body using a pink colouring pencil. Start off by outlining Kirby and start filling them in. Make sure to leave out the hands and the feet. Again, feel free to pause the video. And keep in mind that we're colouring over Kirby's cheeks again. Start filling out Kirby's arms with the previous pink colouring pencil. For the feet, we're going to have to do a lot of shading. Start off with the darker pink that we use on Kirby's cheeks and outline the feet. From here, create some marks like this. Feel free to pause the video and start shading in. Then using the pink, colour over these shadings and enhance the shadows by using the dark pink again. Finally, using a red colouring pencil, colour Kirby's feet entirely. Now for this last step, this is optional. Get a black marker and outline Kirby like this. And here we have the finished drawing of Kirby. Thank you for watching, subscribe and like for more videos and tutorials. Comment down below for any video suggestions and I'll see you next time.